Alright, what's poppin' YouTube? It's the Gamer 187 back again with another video for you guys. Now, um, it's day 8, I believe. This is, let me see, uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Yeah, it's day 8, and um, my PS3 is still not working. I mean, it, it's working, but it's not working. And uh, the reason I say that is because, you know, the, the game, the system still works. You know what I'm saying? It'll still come on and everything. And I can still go into the PlayStation Store and, and, and download games and everything like that. Still go on YouTube, uh, you know what I'm saying, watch movies, this, that, and the third. The, the problem is I can't play any of my games. You know what I'm saying? Like, I put a disc in. It, it makes some weird noise and then the game just never plays so um, last Friday you know I've been trying to get it to work ever since last Friday and it still hasn't worked and last Friday I actually called Sony and talked to some guy he we went through some stuff to uh, see if we could get it to work and one of, and one of the things that we did was had to you know restore it or whatever he said to do and basically that wiped out all my shit like I mean all every like everything that I downloaded is still on my system so I can just go back and re-download it like all the DLC that I downloaded for Injustice um you know Call of Duty all of that uh, is, you know what I'm saying, I can still go back and download all that, so I'm good with that. But, you know what I'm saying, I just beat The Last of Us, and all of that is gone. So, if I want to play the story again, I have to play through the story all over again. Um, all my created people in WWE 13, gone. Uh, all my wins and losses and injustice gone so now I have to start all the way back over with that and my PS3 still doesn't work so uh, you know I'm sitting uh, my box came like two or like a day or two ago so now I'm gonna send it off to Sony uh, you know before I go to the movies today uh, I'm gonna send it off to Sony and everything like that see they you know see right here they sent me the stuff to you know that's the thing when they sent it to my house and had to peel it off and then put the other sticker on the box so I can send it back to them then they just gave me the stuff to you know show me how to put it in the box and everything like that and make sure no disc was in it and, and stuff like that and you know, so I, I was pretty I was pissed off when it happened man cuz you know what I'm saying I wasn't I still have my 360 but I don't I didn't have any games for it I didn't have a controller for it I I traded in my controller for something I forgot um but so yeah so now while my my PS3 is uh getting about to get shipped out to Sony you know what I'm saying uh, I'm going to be back on my 360 for now you know what I'm saying um it just got me like a, a three month uh, Xbox Live card yesterday. Uh, got give me a game, uh, but I have to take it back. I got pissed off because and I got to take it back because I didn't go to GameStop. I went to this place called Second and Charles, and they probably they probably don't have a Second and Charles where you're from, but here where I'm from, Second and Charles is basically just like it's kind of it's basically kind of like GameStop. If you see some of my videos, I've talked about Second and Charles before, but it, it's like GameStop. You know, they have a they have it where you can come and trade in stuff, but you can trade in more than uh, video games. You know what I'm saying? You can trade in books, you can trade in uh, tablets, uh, I think cell phones, video games, video game systems. You know what I'm saying? It, it's just like GameStop, but. You know what I'm saying? The store it, it has it has games, uh books, comics. If you know, if you're familiar with uh Books a Million, the store Books a Million, if you've ever had a Books a Million where you're from, that's um that it, you know, they probably turned it into a second and Charles. So second and Charles is basically Books a Million but with video games and 
you know, just with video games added on to it and where you can come and, uh, you know, trade stuff in. So, um, yeah, I bought a game from Books A Million yesterday, brought it back home, uh, put it in my Xbox, tried to play it, and neither, and it was a two-disc game, and neither of the discs worked. So now I'm pissed off. I got to take it back um, to Second and Charles. Um, and it, and the fucked up thing about it is I still have Black Ops 2 for um, my 360 and it's scratched the hell up and it still plays I, and I don't see why those two games couldn't play in my 360 but scratched up as Call of Duty and I've had I've had Call of Duty for for a while on my 360 I've had it for a while and um that still that still plays good i mean it doesn't recognize it sometimes but you know all i gotta do is just wipe it off and and it'll recognize it just like that and you know so i played a couple matches i've even downloaded the new vengeance map and, and played a little bit of that um yeah i might play some of that before i leave but um yeah, you know, so uh, I'm going to be on my 360 uh, from now on and until Sony. I got to get my get my PS3 uh, shipped out to Sony, you know what I'm saying? The faster I get it shipped out, the faster I can get it back, you know what I'm saying? So uh, I'm going to be on my 360 from uh, from now on. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, so uh, I'm going to put my, uh, my gamer tag like somewhere in the video, probably like in the middle or something like that. So... Uh, you know what I'm saying, if you got a 360, you know, uh, add me on there, you know what I'm saying, and, you know, yeah. So, uh, just wanted to give you guys a little quick update. Uh, I am going to see The Conjuring uh, today, you know what I'm saying. Um, I've seen Grown Ups too. I may or may not do a review on that, um, but uh, look out for my review of The Conjuring. You know what I'm saying? I, I can't wait to see it uh, it's by the same guys that did Saw and the first Insidious and Insidious 2, which I can't wait for. It comes out in September. So, um, yeah, check out for that and uh, look out for more videos from your boy. Uh, I'm going to try to get some gameplays in. Um, I'm going to try to remember how to hook up the, my uh, Hot Pod to my 360 because it's been a while since I did that. So, um yeah uh probably get some uh call some black ops 2 vengeance uh gameplays in for you guys so yeah i'm gonna try to get that hooked up but uh yeah thank you guys for watching man on this little update and you know i'll see you guys later as always salute peace and love